Okay, so I'm going to be giving you guys a method that will give you basically 100% shiny secrets as I managed to get my zoo shiny guaranteed and I'm going to show you guys how to do it as well. So you want to make your way over to the Chimera jungle world real quick and then you want to go ahead and get a 50 to 70% chance. So if I go ahead and put a normal fighter in, as you can see, a 50% chance is going to be around 13 to 15 fruits right here. If we go ahead and put 15 in, that's a 54%. And then if we also go ahead and do around 27, that's a 75%. So what I did for this guy right here, my shiny Zeus, I did 27 secret fruits, which is a 75% chance, which is one in four. But then what I did is I went ahead and I took, say, a normal epic fighter and I did a few 27 fruits. So I did a few 75 75% until one failed so you keep going until one of them fail and then as soon one of as soon as one of them go ahead and fail that's when you do your shiny secret or shiny mythical or shiny divine or whatever good fighter you're trying to make shiny this won't work as well if you're doing say 5% because most of them are always going to fail so I'd recommend that you guys use this method if you're going ahead and doing around 50 to 75% chances because those are the ones that are going to give you the highest chances of actually succeeding say you have a 75 percent chance on a epic fighter it's very unlikely that that's going to fail so as soon as one of those fail your chances of your next one succeeding are very very high so i've i've failed 75 percent before and now from using this method i managed to succeed my shiny secret first try and i will go ahead and do it again with another 27 as soon as i can when i get more fruits so yeah that's basically the method that will get you guys all of these shiny secrets um almost guaranteed every try i found this method off another person's channel called nels tv so if you guys want to go sub to his channel credits to him for the idea go ahead and subscribe to his channel as he's a really good player at this game and he has really good tips on the game as well so make sure to check him out but yeah as you guys can see i did manage to succeed my shiny zeus at the moment it's only got a ton tiny passive but i'm gonna keep re-rolling him whenever i get shards or robux so i can re-roll him and i'm just gonna keep getting him better and better during the double luck event i got him to level 215 so that means that he's already only 10 levels off max level and even when there's another luck event or xp event i can go ahead and get him all the way up to say 220 and then just incubate him until he's 225 so i'll most likely this update be able to go ahead and get four max level fighters because i'll be able to first off go ahead and get these two to max level which is my sh two shiny giant swords those two are going to be max level very very soon as soon as they come out the incubator and then i'll go ahead and incubate these two straight away as well as they're only 10 days off and then by next update i will have four max level units and then the only ones i'll have left are these two right here and then i'll also have a couple leader threes on my team which is very very op make sure you guys do have leader three fighters on your team because they will help you out a lot also make sure you guys go ahead and check out yesterday's video if you guys want to know how to get basically infinite max opens if you guys want to go check that video out as well then feel free to go ahead and do so and yeah let me know what luck event or event you guys want there to be this weekend as currently it is thursday so we have two days until the event i'm hoping that we get a yen and xp event I just hope that at least one of them is yen because then I'll be able to go ahead and top my yen back up because I'm running pretty low after opening every day. The update's nearly been out for a week and I'm running a little bit low. I've only got 3.6 E left. So that will definitely last me till the weekend. So hopefully we get a yen event because then I can top up on yen over the weekend and that will last me until next update, which is what I also recommend you guys do if there is a yen event. And the luck events, to be honest, I don't really want a luck event because the luck events don't really seem to help at all um, from experience like hatching secrets and stuff they don't seem to really give you any extra luck I seem to just pull the same units as I usually do so basically the best event they could probably add is a yen event and an xp event or a yen event and a damage event um, or the other way around whatever you want to say yen event damage event luck event damage event xp event damage event whichever 
one. I'm pretty sure the best three, though, are XP, Yen, and Damage. Those are the three best things they add in events. So hopefully they go ahead and add two of those three in next event so we can go ahead and top up on Yen and XP and all of that. And there is also a Meteor, so let me go ahead and quickly claim that and see if I can get a secret fruit. All right, let's go ahead and see. I have no secret fruit left right now, as you guys can see. Only 10 divine fruit. Let's go ahead and break this open and do we get one? Okay, no, we didn't, but I do need to save up some of these and these so I can craft myself some more secret fruits. That'd be pretty OP. And one more tip that I would like to give you guys. Make sure before the weekend, you guys top up on as many defense tokens as you can, as if there's a double luck event, we're going to be able to get 300 billion every single defense mode, 300 billion multi opens, which is going to last you a whole night of AFKing. So three defense modes would be basically 24 hours of max opens. So make sure you guys go ahead and top up on defense tokens before the weekend comes. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. I've been trying to make eight minute videos again, as you guys did say you preferred the longer videos. So let me know in the comments if you made it this far into the video, as I really appreciate everyone that watches the entire video. And yeah, let me know what team you guys have in the game right now. Let me know if you guys are at the max world and if you guys have any shiny divines, as I do need to get a shiny divine on my team as currently I do have how many shiny secrets do I have one two three four five six so I need one more fighter for a full team of shiny secrets but then I do want to get a shiny divine so I want to go for like a red bat or something so I can get that as shiny and I do have a 40% chance right now so I am kind of high on the chances it's basically a 50 50 coin flip whether I'd get it or not so hopefully I am able to go ahead and get a shiny divine pretty soon but yeah that's pretty much it for today's video hopefully you guys did all enjoy if you did make sure to drop a fat like subscribe and i'll see you all in the next one peace out guys